Another very special guest on this Valentine's Day morning, all getting ready for the new tale as old as time. You can hear Ariana Grande, John Legend, singing the new version of that classic from Beauty and the Beast. That means we have one of the stars from the film. Everybody, welcome Luke Evans. <laughs> From oh, the no, no, no. Oh, oh, there we go. All right. Michael was my body double on the Beauty and the Beast. Yes. <laughs> I would be so lucky, my friend. Congratulations yeah. on, on the film. And yeah. how was it to play Gaston? Oh, I mean, it's one of those jobs you just uh, mm. love going into work to play. You know, I didn't want it to finish. He's um, he's a total idiot. Really. <laughs> <laughs> um, the best. But just so much fun. You know, he's um, he's the lovable rogue of the village. Tries to get Belle, makes a complete idiot of himself, and then, you know, you see this man this become a, a complete monster throughout the film. So yeah. it was it was great, and we were surrounded by amazing people. Josh Gad plays LeFou, who we love, mm. a very funny man, mm -hmm. makes me look funny, although I'm not. <laughs> no, the, uh, the cast is unbelievable. Yeah, I, I want to yes. I want to rattle it off because everybody, yeah. if you haven't heard about it yet, it's quite remarkable. Emma Watson, Dan Stevens from Downton Abbey. Um, also, Sir Ian McKellen. Wow. Ian McKellen. What was that like? Wonderful. Well, I didn't work with him on that, but obviously I know him from playing Gandalf in uh, right. The Hobbit. From so the uh, Hobbit. it was nice to go back and do another job with him. Although he was just a clock in my. <laughs> 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 a clock with a very, very Shakespearean voice. Nurse, we're seeing a lot of pictures from behind yeah. the scenes oh, there that you oh, yeah, posted. I know you guys, uh, yeah. everybody has been saying you had great chemistry as friends. That's I'm them telling me, I, I, they're saying, you don't know your lines, Luke. Can you just, uh, <laughs> <laughs> but you also, um, you and Josh gave us um, a little taste of another Disney classic on the set. Can we take, can we roll it, everybody, before we see Ooh, the clip? Just this is behind the scenes. I like that you're you holding the uh, <laughs> You have to do the. the yeah, it goes from musical theater to background. You see, if you never guess, you <laughs> <laughs> Take a look at this clip from the new version. It's pretty great. This one ranked this experience. Oh, uh, very, very near the top, if not the top. It's um, it's Disney, you know. You, yeah. you sort of you bring in an animated character that people have known for so long to life, and it's an honor. But it's so much fun, so much fun. And I couldn't I, go far enough with the character. You know, I was it was just brilliant. So it was, I was I was reading your history. I had no idea. A lot of musical theater too. You were yeah, in Rent. Yeah, yeah, I did. I did. I played End. Roger in Rent and uh, Chris in oh. Miss Saigon and. I was even in Avenue Q. I was one of the puppets. Oh, were you? Uh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Done yeah. it all. Yeah. Done it all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's um, so singing was my first love. So um, there's a song there, uh, and I wanted to bring it back. And it was nice to be able to merge the film career with the musical theatre career. And uh, this was it. This was the role. And um, we've been waiting almost 18 months to be able to talk to you guys about it. Wow. You know, yeah. And now finally we have. Yeah. Two weeks to yeah. yeah. so, yeah. so, so no hesitation. You get this call and say, play a cartoon character. I can't uh, wait. Almost, almost. <laughs> I mean, the funny story is that when they came to me with the, the role, they were like, we want to see you for Gaston. I was like, yeah, but the Beast is the main character. You know? I'm like, Why am I not being asked to play the Beast? Um, but uh, I watched it with my godchildren because I hadn't seen it for ages. And I, I thought, my god, this character is huge. I can do something great with this. And um, so yeah, I mean, it was actually the animation, re-watching the animation that sold it to me. Actually watching them looking themself, himself in the mirror and tell him how beautiful, beautiful he was to himself. was like, okay, this is going to be fun. <laughs> well, we can't, we can't wait to we see We can't it. wait. The, the yeah. anticipation is just, yeah, you are lovely. Just a lovely soul. Absolutely. Yeah. Thank you very really much. Thank you for being here. Oh, it's nice to be here. Happy Valentine's. Yeah. Happy Valentine's. Yes.
Beauty and the Beast in its theaters March 17th. We cannot wait.